fucking chilling. It's banned. All right, Dan. My bad, man. I had to uh, I had to take care of some business over here at this uh, distribution center where I'm at, man. But uh, thanks for reaching out to me. I do appreciate it. What's the name of the company? Fralian Chilling Trucking. Fralian and Chilling. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm familiar with uh, I'm familiar with you guys' trucks out here on the road. Uh, you know, y'all 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 offer or whatever you guys offering came through my Facebook page, man. Uh, can you tell me uh, a little bit about the company and what you guys have to offer? Sure. So you in the Cleveland area, is that right? Yeah. Uh, in your area, what I have to offer, I'd either have a, a regional van or a home uh, home weekly dedicated flatbed. So uh, both be home weekly. Uh, vans will run about fourteen fifty to seventeen hundred a week. Flatbeds will run about seventeen to two thousand dollars a week. Um, need six months of tractor trailer experience can be local or on the road uh, either one uh, but need a minimum six months experience uh, we've been around since 1955 um, kind of what we do is we can we can haul more weight than anybody else on, without a permit so it allows us to get a good customer base that we service so we don't really mess with brokers or anything like that so uh, we keep you moving and get you home so it's really right. consistent steady pay Okay, so you guys, so you guys do both van and and flatbed work. We do, yep. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Now you you mentioned, uh, you know, my next question was how much experience do uh do we need? So the 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 experience is what six months coming in or or four months or what? Six need six months of uh, tractor trailer experience. All right. So, if they only need six months for the uh, for the experience, uh, what what do they need for the flatbed? Or do you guys train? We train for flatbed. So just six months tractor trailer overall. Okay. 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 So, uh, for so for you guys train for securement and all like that. Yeah. Uh, how long we is do. how how long is how long is that? Like how long's the orientation for Four training? Days. For, for flatbed, I mean for flatbed securement. Yep, four days. Oh, okay. All right, all right. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Um, what type of benefits do you guys have? Got health, dental, vision, long term, short term disability, four hundred one k. Of course, paid vacations, six paid holidays. We have full package. So, uh, it's the it's the health benefits. Is that company paid or is it uh is it a uh, half paid? It's seven dollars and fifty cents for an individual per week. Um, would be what you'd be responsible for as far as the premium goes. Okay, okay. What what's what's the health insurance that you guys go through for seven dollars? You're not in healthcare. Oh, uh, okay, okay. So it's not Anthem, Blue Cross, Blue Shield. It's not. It's United Healthcare, UMR. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Now you mentioned uh, you you mentioned home time uh, that you guys could get us home uh, every every week. So is that fr- uh-huh. is is that Friday coming in and back out Monday? Uh, no, sir. If you if you leave say Monday morning, you use it back Saturday morning. If you leave Sunday afternoon, you use it back Friday afternoon. So we try to do forty eight hours is what we try to hit. Oh, okay. So it's a full. So it's a full two. Try to be a full two days off, other than a uh, uh, just the thirty four. Yep. Try to hit forty eight. There go. All right. Are we able? Are uh, the equipment that you guys uh, that that will be driving? Uh, what what are they and what are they governed at? Uh, we got Kenworth Freightliner Peterbilt. Nothing over five years of age. Uh, they're automatics and they're governed at sixty eight. 68. Oh, okay. Can we take the truck home? You can. Actually, you would need to truck and trailer. Oh, okay. So, what if I have a place to park the trailer? Can I disconnect and and uh bobtail home and park the tr- uh tractor in my driveway? No, we like we like it to stay coupled. Truck and trailer coupled. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh what about driver facing cameras? We do. We have both ways. All right. Uh, now you was talking about the lanes earlier, you know, for flatbed and for the and for van. Uh, so is this just strictly like a uh, regional, or do you guys do all forty eight, or or what? 
it's regional flatbed you'll see like um indiana illinois pennsylvania ohio mainly and what? you'll see a lot of ohio pennsylvania and tennessee Okay. What what as far as uh as far as flatbed goes, what what do what 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 would we be hauling usually? Coils. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Do you guys do you guys run any northeast and if you do, do you guys pay extra for it? Uh not really. Uh I mean we don't do any New York City anything like that. I mean I think they do have some loads that Go like Oswego, New York, and uh, they got one load that goes over to Connecticut. But yeah, those loads generally carry a higher um, a higher value. The line haul is larger, so we pay percentage. So you start twenty seven percent of the load, and once you get a full month in, you can go as high as thirty. But yeah, the the line hauls on those are usually larger. All right, now is that is that a percentage across the board uh, for van and and uh, flatbed? Yes. Yep. Same thing for both. Okay, and what was and what was the average you said that we we can come home a week? Uh, so gross, you're looking between fourteen fifty to seventeen hundred a week for van flat. You're looking about seventeen to two. All right, now you now for those averages, uh, we we doing like maybe like what three four loads a week at least. Yeah, generally, yeah, I'll take around four four to five. Okay. You guys, uh, what about what what about orientation? How how would you? Uh, it's this is a three part. So, how how would you guys get me there? How uh, what's the, say what? Enterprise rental car. Oh okay okay well what? Yeah I'm, I have issues with enterprise. Um, let me ask you this: If I was to rent my own car, would you guys reimburse me? We would. Yeah, we'd reimburse you the cost of. Uh, of um, what we'd pay for the rental, so, yeah, we reimburse you our cost. All right, I I don't think I asked, but where would the orientation be? Knoxville, Tennessee. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, what about uh, what about uh, uh pre-employment drug testing? Is it hair follicles or urine or both? Urine. Oh, okay, and the hotel stay solo. Yes. <laughs> okay, okay, that's what's up. Uh. Is there a sign-on bonus? Uh, there is. It's five thousand dollars. First five hundred of which will come on your first check. Uh, it pays out within a, a full year. So let me get it pulled up here. We just changed it for the fourth quarter. Hold on. You say it's paid out a full year? Yeah, over a year. I'll <laughs> take that. That's paid out. One second. And you say it's five, and, and it's five grand. It sure is. You get five hundred dollars on your first check. You get a thousand at ninety days, fifteen hundred at six months, and then two grand at a year. Oh, okay, okay. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Uh, you know, I got a, I got a, I got a driver buddy uh, that drives for you guys. I think he drives for you guys currently. Um, I also talked to a couple of guys that you know that that previously drove for you guys because you know I'm in the Facebook group and you know I mentioned I mentioned the company. You know, there's, you know, some drivers has varied opinions about, you know, the companies that they drove for previously. Sure. Um, so if, you know, for bringing me on and for the drivers that's already there, what do you do to retain your drivers? Well, I mean, we treat drivers right and they get paid well and they get home when they want. Um, generally, I mean, that's, you get those three things right the rest of it takes care of itself so i mean especially home time pay you get those right i mean the rest of it just falls into place and that starts with bringing on the right person and make sure we meet their goals up front um you know what i mean uh, just like these conversations you know if you're not if you're not okay with the home time and the, the pay you know that we we quote you then you know what i mean we we always we don't try to just get guys into orientation so you know i'll be the first one to tell you we might not be the right fit for you so um, you know, we, we get guys that want to be on weekly and, you know, uh, want to make that set amount of money. And, you know, if you get those two things right, generally everything else falls in place. So okay. and we do a pretty good job of meeting expectations. Okay, that's what's up, man. Thank you very much for that. Uh, can you guys can you guys help drivers get their CDLs for the ones that don't have it? We can't, unfortunately. Uh, I usually recommend people uh, to a couple different companies, but, no, we do require um, at least six months of tractor trailer. 
I'll tell you, we just started our six-month program, so it's a little bit tighter. Um, some drivers will fall into needing a full 12 months, so it's been on work history and whatnot. So. All right, all right. And uh, sorry for rewinding back, but the percentage pay, is that is that – base for everybody uh experience coming into the coming into you guys or you know like a driver like myself i got six months i mean six years uh do i get uh do i get paid more percentage you don't um you start at 27 percent and we try to pay guys for production you know what i mean um you come in you work hard and most guys usually end up getting up to 30 percent um you know at least 29 30 so I mean that's where you that's where you boost your percentage. So, um, I right. believe in a, a clean plate when you come here. So you know what I mean. All right, all right. Well, I appreciate the time, man. Thank you very much. Hey, man, appreciate you. Thanks, sir. All right, now, thank you.